Hi, it's Regan with more designs. I just wanted to share with you my circle journal for the Travelogs group number two over at your paper pantry. Um, I just finished it up and it will be going out in the mail to Michelle in New York tomorrow. And um, I didn't do the front and back cover because I didn't want it to get damaged during all of the... Um, all of the be all of being mailed, you know, like eight times. So, anyways, I left the chipboard, and when I get it back, I'll bind I'll bind it with the binding um, spines or bind bind doll spines. Um, so the front, the inside of the front cover, I just used some K and Company um, postcard paper, and then this is um, craft cardstock that um, I stamped with different stamps. Um, this is a script stamp by Hero Arts. Th these stamps and the Enjoy the Journey is Tim Holtz. The clock is stamping up, which I don't even know if you can see. And then I just used a real stamp to pop up to give it something extra. And then this is my welcome page and it just explains that my circle journal is a hometown travel guide and that everyone is supposed to um, do a two page layout highlighting their hometown and they can use brochures and maps and postcards, real photos, stamps, whatever that whatever they want to do for their pages. Um, and then this is my sign in pages I guess. I did one half of the map here and the other half here and then this is my information pocket and inside I have instructions on how to sign in and it just says to take a thumbtack from this little pocket and like I did here put your thumbtack where over your hometown and then um, then each person in this little pocket has a postcard like that where they can um, I'll do I'll show you mine um, you can put their the, or they can sign in on these postcards. They can put their name, their town, state, country, and then they need to put the date that they received it and the date they mailed it. And then on the back, I left it blank. So if they wanted to make their own um, postcard by placing a picture of themselves or of somewhere in their hometown, they could make their own postcards. And so that's the sign in page. And then these are my pages. Um, this was a photo that I had. Um, from one of our trips to the beach and it didn't have anybody in it so I thought it'd be a good picture and then um, I put you know where where my hometown is Navarre and then I wrote about about living here and what there is to do um, like the Golfarium and the zoo and some of my favorite restaurants and I added some flowers and then this is linen and I stamped with Cherish um, this is linen. I added some real seashells. And so that's just to give you a little idea of what it will look like. And then these are all the pages for everybody else. And then I put an envelope in the back with the postcards on the back cover. So that's my circle journal for the travelog swap at your paper pantry. And then Laura, Contessa Creations, is hosting a stick pin swap. Um, and it's so cute. She calls us the pin up girls. It's, I think that's so cute. Anyways, this is, um, she's the host over at your paper pantry for the stick pen swap, and these are my stick pens that will be going out to her tomorrow as well. Let me see if I can, um, let's see, maybe I can, there we go. So I just punched a scallop circle and poked the pins through, and then um, I had these really thick pop dots, so I slid those over the ends of the pins so they wouldn't prick anybody, and then I put a punched bird on the sticky part of the pop dot, and so when they take the pins out, the bird um, will slide off and it's not sticking to the scallop circle, so they'll be able to use the bird as an embellishment on something else. So there's my stick pins, and I had to do one in a different color. So maybe that will be easier for you guys to see. So there are my stick pens. So that's what um, some of the swaps I'm doing over at your paper pantry. And um, thanks for watching.